A few days ago I was sent in a replica Tudor Black Bay 58 and I thought, what better way to review this watch than as Adrian from Bark and Jack. So, we're gonna go take a look at it right now. Say hello Enzo. Welcome back to Jock and Back. My name's Adrian. Today we are reviewing the Tudor Black Bay Bronze Edition with Arabic numerals. Now, this watch is a replica. Fake, mind you, I don't know. I don't know how to. What's the proper way to put it? It's uh, rubbish. Complete rubbish. Trash. But it does come on a nice NATO strap there. How could I plug the Jock and Back? shop where we sell natos and coffee how could i plug it to say we have coffee and straps over at jockandback.shop slash coffee slash straps oh, i don't know anyways back to the watch now this watch is is something i don't know how to put it in words it 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 just there's complete rubbish, and then there's complete elephant dung. And that's what this watch is. It's just elephant dung, and it's just terrible. Terrible by all respects. Down to the strap. If you want a good quality strap, go ahead and visit jockandback.shop slash NATO strap slash coffee, where you can pick up a new NATO strap for your replica watch. If you're going to buy this watch, which I recommend you do not buy this watch, at least get a good strap for it over at jockandback.shop.io.shop. This watch is trying to be something it's not. It's trying to be a Tudor, but it's something much, much less than that. It's it's complete and utter rubbish. As you can see, the, the bronze on the front of the watch does not even resemble the same bronze on the back of the watch. It It's just complete and utter, utter garbage. Excuse me, coffee break. Oh yeah, give it to me, daddy. Speaking of coffee, I do have a new blend of Jock and Beck Dark Brew. It is grown in the mountainsides of Nicaragua. I'm just going to go ahead and try this out for a little bit here. Excuse me, I need another coffee break. Oh. You can find the same coffee at jockandback.com slash coffee slash nato strap. Oh, Whew. really wakes you up. Now back to the Tudor. Now this strap is absolute. Oh, where's the watch? <laughs> Oops, excuse me. There. This watch is absolute rubbish. It doesn't even fit the case. It's, it's it's much too small. The movement's much too small for the actual watch. It feels like you're winding up a a movement through sand and dirt and farts. That's what it's like. It, 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 it doesn't have that same je ne sais quoi, or however the, the French say it. The French word for coffee is coffee. So if you want to buy some new coffee, go ahead and go to jockandback.com slash coffee slash jack. Now this bezel is a 60 click bezel. I think one, two, three, four, five, six. D click bezel. It feels like you're turning it through air. It, it, the back play is extraordinarily bad. It, it doesn't have that same Tudor click, you know? It's just very, very shallow, very, very bad. Ugh. It's just the complete opposite of my coffee over at jockandback.com slash coffee where you can buy high-quality coffee and high-quality straps all in one location. So if you have a coffee enthusiast and a watch enthusiast and a coffee enthusiast, you can find exactly what you need over at jockandbag.com slash shop. Oh, I love coffee. Love coffee. The dial is this coffee-colored brown. Speaking of coffee, you can get your coffee at jockandbag.com slash coffee. The bronze has patina quite fast actually it, it it's almost like it's not even real bronze and with it being how light it is i don't see how it can actually be real bronze 
It's almost like I'm lost for words. But what I'm not lost for words are of my straps over at BarkandJack.com. I have NATO straps. I have Tropic straps. I have leather straps. I have crocodile straps. I have patented leather straps. I have sailcloth straps. I have all sorts of straps. Straps and coffee. That's all I have at BarkandJack.com slash coffee slash shop. Go ahead and visit it. Thank you very much. If you like this style of content, please subscribe below. If you love this video, like below. If you love the style of cinematography and coffee, please hit the bell icon below. I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, hopefully you like that style of content. Um, I got sent in this replica watch from uh, Watch Chris and Matt Stingray. And I didn't know how to um, pretty much film a review, so... A few months back, I asked Adrian, I DM'd him, I said, hey, would you mind if I, you know, made a parody video of you? And he said, you know, no problem, whatever. So I figured this tutor would be a, a good stepping stone into doing a or trying to do a um, parody video just to, to see if you guys actually enjoy the style of content. Uh, I love doing parody stuff. It's just very simple, very easy. And uh, I think I get you know, poke fun a little bit, and it's all in good fun. Adrian's a great guy, awesome content. A lot of his stuff is, not a lot, all of his stuff really, is shot very well. He does very good camera work, and um, yeah, it's just, uh, just a nice, easy way to, uh, I don't know, laugh at our, laugh at ourselves as watch enthusiasts. So hopefully Adrian sees this, and he doesn't, you know, throw my channel under the bus yeah ho hopefully i did a good adrian impression i don't know if i did I'm, I'm not that good with accents so hopefully it came across as as good but yeah it was all in good fun so thanks for watching if you like this style of content please subscribe below hit the bell button do all that youtube stuff there's links below in the description affiliate links links to my social media pages go ahead follow me on those if you want um, and then, yeah, so that's the video. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. I'm gonna pop up a couple videos here, one right here, one right here, subscribe in the middle. And, uh, yeah, that's about it. So thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys later.